Okay, finally, here we are. Uh, I apologize. I know I said I was going live at 1.30. And, uh, you know, the whole lunchtime you, uh, for chiropractors, it's two hours. And we usually have about, like, 12 hours of work to condense down in there. So I never know how long I'm going to be on the phone with an insurance company, which is what happened. So we'll blame it on the insurance company and the reason that I'm late getting on here talking to you all. So the topic for today is what do you slash should you expect from your chiropractor? And this comes because I've had a couple of people call the office in the last couple of weeks and I'm a little, I'm confused and I don't know if you know people who who have this thought or if perhaps you have thought like this before but um but if these are things that I'm going to talk about if these are things that you've thought of uh or if it's the antithesis of what you think I would like to know that because we need to figure out why do people think that what they do is um okay so so here's the deal. So I had I had a patient a couple of weeks ago call who wanted uh, to come in as a chiropractic patient. Um, she sounded uh, she sounded older, and she told me that she has um, sciatica really badly, so severe sciatic pain. And she wanted to come in, and she wanted to come in that day and get adjusted. And I said, well, you know, you've had this before. I forget how many years she said she'd been dealing with it. And I said, I, and, and this is how I operate. So this is what you can expect from me. I will do a complete orthopedic, neurologic, and chiropractic spinal exam on you, as well as take any and all potential x-rays that we need to determine the exact cause of what is going on with you. I will also do a motion study to determine how the spine is moving uh, on those x-rays, I can see the movement of the spine on a motion study x-ray. I will do a detailed x-ray analysis of you and come up with a comprehensive plan and program to help gain correction of your spinal issue that is causing you chronic pain, chronic inflammation, and affecting your health in some adverse way. Okay, so that's how I operate. So when someone calls and they say, I just need my back cracked, okay? And I go, first of all, when you say that, people, I'm gonna tell you, it's like fingernails down a chalkboard to a chiropractor, all right? It, it's just like, uh, because listen, if you want your back cracked, go find a seven-year-old to walk on your back. Like seriously, like that, you, why would you even come here and pay money? So she, I tell this woman this and she says, uh, well, I know what's wrong with me. I have bad sciatic pain. And I said, I understand. I don't know what's wrong with you and I don't know where it's coming from because the sciatic nerve comes from five different spinal levels. Did you all know that? Five spinal levels and then it comes together and it forms a big bundle and it forms the sciatic nerve that goes down into your leg and causes all those problems. So I don't know what's wrong with you and you have a severe neurological issue and a severe neurological deficit. I am not about to just light into your spine. So what do some people expect? They expect to just walk into the chiropractor's office and they expect to get cracked with no rhyme, no reason, no evaluation, nothing, and just blindly, I mean, it's like going to the dentist and say, just pull my tooth. And the dentist has to say, well, I need to evaluate. I've got to take some x-rays. I need to figure out exactly where the cavity is. Well, the pain is here. Take them all. Why would you do that? You know, like, why would you do that? Um, had another, another um, phone call. And a um, young man said, uh, you know, I tell him the same thing. And he says, I just need my back cracked. And I said, well, I, I don't know what you need. So I need to do my evaluation to determine that. And, um, and he, he like huffed and puffed on the phone. He wasn't happy. Um, I've, I've also, in the same respect, I've had people, I do my evaluation. And then I've had people um, get upset that I don't just adjust them right there. So no, I do a lot of work to determine what you need specifically and how to improve your health. And so because of that work, I need to then evaluate the work to come up with, as I said, a comprehensive plan and program to help correct this so that you can live a better life, a life with vitality, a life without pain, and a life with better energy and, and just more activity. All right, so 
what should you expect from your chiropractor? You should expect your chiropractor is going to do a complete evaluation of your spine. It is your spine. You do not get to replace this. You do not get more than one. And it houses your nervous system. So uh, you want somebody taking care of that, all right? That is what you should expect. If you are someone who has thought in the past, well, I could just walk in and get my back cracked. I really want to know why. Like I, like I genuinely am interested in, in why people think that that's okay. Because I would love to have that conversation and say, you know, um, here's why that shouldn't happen. Of course, I just explained that, right? But like I said, um, for the young man who called and said that, like, go find a seven-year-old. You don't need to come and pay my prices if you just want your back cracked. It's going to be nonspecific. It will probably harm you more than it will do you any good. And you know what? That's really all you're asking me to do. So um, so anyway, that's what you should expect. You should expect somebody who's going to take care, who's going to look at you with a fine tooth comb, be very specific about what your needs are. Um, you would not walk into a surgeon's office and say, hey doc, uh, just take my appendix out. Well, how do I know it's your appendix? How do I know it's not a, um, a blocked intestine? How do I know you didn't pull a groin? How do I, okay, hop up on the table. Let's cut you open and take out that appendix. like. <laughs> All right, so let's shift these thoughts, let's change our mindset, and let's understand that chiropractors are going to help get to the root cause and help keep you from actually getting onto that surgical table. All right, there it is for today. That's what you can expect from a chiropractor. Please pass this along to anybody that you know who is dealing with chronic pain and chronic aches and cannot get them under control and needs somebody to look at them with detailed analysis to determine exactly what, what is causing it so we can get it corrected. All right, have an amazing Tuesday and we'll talk to y'all soon, bye.